everybody, it's Jackie. Welcome back to my channel. Today I have a very exciting LA Girl palette video for you. I stopped by my local Ulta to see if I could pick up the Break Free palettes because as you know, I've been having trouble getting my Break Free palettes broken and Ulta sent me some replacements. However, they did ship them in the same manner as the first one. Uh, just thrown in a bubble envelope. So these arrived broken as well and Ulta has told me that they do everything that they can do to ship their palettes so I don't get them damaged. But anyways, although the mirror isn't broken and what I've determined is that these shades that are getting broken are in the exact same location. So I think what's happening to them is when they run them through the postal machinery, they're getting smashed by being stamped with some kind of uh, machine there. So, whoo, look at that one. That one has just broken the house. So anyways, they gave me a refund and they're not shipping me any more LA Girl palettes, um, even though it's a short distance from Texas to Arkansas. They're done with me. So with my refund, I went in and I've been trying to buy these in store. Um, however, I was not able to get them. They don't have them yet. They do have them at the LA Girl website, but I prefer to buy them at Ulta because a lot of times you can just get buy one, get one half off, or they just recently had buy two, get one free. And if you go to the website, you're paying the full price, $15.99 uh, in shipping as well. So anyways, unable to get them. Uh, I have a $35 um, uh, gift card from Ulta, and I was able to find the brand new LA Girl Keep It Playful. These just came out. They're little nine pan palettes and they're really pretty. They have a metallic uh, box. They're about the si same size as the Huda palettes, all the little, but they look like the big palettes. And I was so excited. Well, they don't look, not the same shade, but it looks like the same formula. So I was so excited to get them and try them out. So this is gonna be a first impressions and I'm gonna swatch them. Then I'm gonna go on to a uh, get ready with me. So um, we'll just start off with the swatches. So y'all who wanna uh, just check that out and get out of here. But anyways, let's start out with the very first one. I was really drawn to this one. This is the Downplay palette. The Keep It Playful series Downplay palette. And this is the smoky one and I think it is the most beautiful. These are $9.99, which is such a great deal. And again, this one has got kind of a smoky metallic packaging. There are no shade names on the palette, so it just is what it is. There's no mirror, but I do like that there is a, a see-through case, so I appreciate that. I'd rather have that than the mirror anyways. And let me just get it open. They are sealed, so people can't tamper with them. And let me just get this open. It looks like a... Um, it's just a great smoky palette. Is that not gorgeous for fall? So I'm just gonna swatch these for you. And again, this is the Downplay palette. So they look like the same, but uh, made in China, designed in the USA, but made in China. Uh, the number one ingredient is talc. The second ingredient is mica and so on. So if you are talc sensitive, you want to avoid that. However, I don't have a problem with it. I think some of the best eyeshadows made uh, especially uh, by Viseart, the number one ingredient is talc. So anyways, just great. You, all your top six shades are your browns, and then you have your charcoals and your grays. You have one, two, three, four, five mattes around this outside, and then you have your little metallic quad right here. So I'm just gonna go left, oh yeah, they feel just like they feel just like the big palettes, very soft. All right, let's just swatch these. These will be uh, great for your transitions. Those are very pretty. Those are gonna be, it's great to have a white, um, and it's great to have, this is a perfect transition color, the second one and then a deeper transition, uh, that, that's good. All right, so now let me do the next three, uh, which is two of the metallics. Yeah, look at that, 
very, very pretty. I'm always amazed with how well LA Girl does their, wow, look at that swatch. Oh my God, that is stunning. That brown metallic, let me just, that is, oh my God. Oh my gosh, it is everything I thought it was and more. Those are beautiful, beautiful metallics. Wow, look at this palette. Woo, all right. Now the last row. These look a bit more chunkier. Again, they have a great feel. Holy moly, look at that. Oh my gosh, you guys, get these. Oh wow. Oh my goodness. And the black mat. Wow. That is the best $9.99. And actually, I had $30 in points, so I picked these up. I got these pallets for free. Oh, my God. Look at that. Stunning. So they're all soft, buttery. Oh, my God. That is the downplay palette. All right, I can't wait to get this on my eyes. Okay, well, I'm gonna swatch the other palettes real quick for, and uh, if anybody wants, yeah. Oh my goodness, this is amazing. I want a backup. <sighs> wow, I'm okay, I'm blown away. So this one, this next one is uh, the kind of the orangey one for fall, and it's in kind of an orangey packaging. And this one is in the is called Foreplay. The name of the palette is right here, Foreplay. Uh, and let me show you the first one. That's Downplay, right here. Unbelievable! What quality it is! It's the exact same formula as the big palettes. I've got my makeup done except for my eyeshadow and my mascara. I just wanted to. I wanted to do a first impressions, and my first impressions is blown away. When I saw them, I couldn't even believe it. I was like, oh my God, look at these. How can you do this for $10? I mean, China. But look at those orange tones. That is so pretty. That is perfect for fall. Okay, so again, top row, uh, let's see what we've got here for mattes. Okay, these are kind of scattered. So you got matte, matte, matte. And then these bottom two are mattes. Uh, look at that tangerine shimmer. That uh, That's gonna be, go oh, oh my gosh, these two, this copper, wow. And this deep, this looks like a, this is what the Natasha Denona bronze palette should have been. Oh my gosh, because it didn't have the light shades. They were all kind of the oranges. This is, yes, oh my gosh. If you're thinking about Natasha Denona bronze, get this instead. If you haven't picked it up, oh my gosh, this is, this is it. Okay, so let me uh, get these. Look at that, that's your top row. So pretty, look at that tangerine. Love that, oh my gosh. I'm just gonna go over my swatches again with my let me get a little bit more. So pretty. Again, it's great that you have a nice white transition. You've got the, uh, everything you need. It's an all-in-one palette. The metallics are soft and but Look at that. Look at that foil.
very, very gleamy, metallic without being chunky. No, f look at my, look at my fingers. These are stunning. This is definitely a beautiful orange. And your last row. Wow. Oh my gosh. I'm in love. I can't wait to use these. I'm going to use these all fall. No words. And again, that is your four play palette from the Keep It Playful LA Girl series. $9.99. Amazing. I mean, that's that's a buck a shadow and a dollar for the case. You can't... <sighs> wow. And the last one, now I want to put this one on. Okay, so the last one is your rosy one. This is called Playmate, and it's in the pink rose packaging. Playmate. I've just totally jacked up my manicure. I didn't see that they were sealed, but I like that. I like that people can't get into them and swatch them before you get into them. Not that they're letting you do that anyways at Ulta. They're really watching people. Okay, so here's all your, your berries. Wow, that is so pretty. Let me open up Break Free and see. No, that's not even. It's kind of a mix of browns and pink. No, they're not even close. But it is the same formula. That's the great news. L.A. Girl has discovered the secret to great quality at a very, very inexpensive price. They, they have mastered it. They have, they have mastered it. I mean, ColourPop does a good job. Juvia's Place does a good job. But LA Girl has mastered the inexpensive eyeshadow formula. This one has, let's see, you've got one, two, three, four mattes and and you've got this shimmer here, but even these flaky shimmers are really swatching nice. So you've got five, four mattes, five shimmers. So this one's got, uh, I believe, the most shimmers of any of these. But these are your pinky tones and your berry tones. And again, you've got uh, one thing that's nice about all these palettes, they've all got a white, they've all got the transition shades, and then you've got a dark shade that you can use for a liner. This one doesn't really have a dark shade for a liner, but... Um, this one does so let's uh let's get into this one so there's your top row again look at that let me see where i can do this one at there's your white there's your transition there's your first metallic oh, look at that just Whew. So, so pretty. All right, and your second row. You've got a champagne, -y, a berry, and a dusty. Look at that. Here's your champagne, your berry, metallic and your dusty rose mat. Oh, wow. And then your bottom. This is gonna be your most neutral palette. So you got kind of a, a pink. 
and a kinds of a pinky bronze and a brown. So there's your pink champagne metallic, your kind of pinky bronze, and then your brown. That is amazing. I can't even believe the quality. I know I'm repeating myself. So there's your first one. Your orange. And then the really pretty pinky brown. Playmate. Wow hold them all up next to each other so you can kind of see which one you like. I just, I am so blown away. What a great find. Wow. So if you like your pinks, Go for Playmate. If you need your oranges for fall, get Four Play. And if you want your smoky, get Down Play. Just amazing. LA Girl has done it again. Wow. So, um,. I really love the first, I love them all. The first one is just stunning. I love the browns. I love the smokies. Love the pinks. And love the oranges. Just mind blowing. Okay, so I'm going to keep going. I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to do an eye look real quick. I'm going to use the first one. Just uh, got my uh, Sonia G Sky Eye Set. Um, love these brushes. And I'm just going to, this is going to be quick. I can just tell it's going to be quick. So I'm going to get some of the white. It's kind of a vanilla. And I'm just going to put that all over. These just blend. I've already got my makeup done. And I just... Uh, Wow, this is so pretty. It's just, it's got kind of, a, it's kind of a satin finish, but just blending great. It's just something for all over the eye. Nice brow bone highlight. I just like to have a base all over the lid. But that's pretty. It's got a really pretty kind of satiny pearly sheen um, next I think I'll go into the next shade too and just uh, deepen the crease a little bit put a little bit of buff on there that's pretty just give it a little bit of a depth this stuff is just blending out this is a really good beginner friendly formula because it's sheer buildable you're not gonna like touch your eye and then have a big mistake to try to fix just really easy to work with it's just uh, shearing out nicely I think I'll just go ahead and run that underneath okay next I want to go into I guess I'll do a brown smoky. I'm going to deepen up the crease with this one here. That's nice.
Okay, I'm gonna run this underneath to connect. Oh, so pretty. Looking good. Okay, I really want to get into this really pretty brown metallic here. I'm gonna put that on the eyelid. Oh my goodness. Look at that color payoff. It is just and usually I apply metallics with my finger, but this is working great with a brush. And usually you need a more stiffer brush. I'm using, you know, this is my natural hair brush. And it is just, oh my God. Look at that, blending like a dream. Oh my goodness. They have outdone themselves with these palettes. This is gonna, I don't know why people don't talk about LA Girl very much. Uh, this one should put them on the map. That is outstanding. I love it. I'm going to go into this uh, kind of a silvery gray. I'm going to put that in the center. Uh, not the center, excuse me, the um, corner of my eye. Okay, I think I need to press that one in with my finger. There we go. There, that's better. Yeah, that flakier one does work a little bit better with the finger. Oh my God, I'm loving it. Um, and I want to, since it has the black, I want to get some of this black and run that on as a liner. I'm gonna use my Wayne Goss on that one. Just a push, just a push liner. Smoke it out. Great black. Wow, I'm loving this. I want some more. I'm going to take this center shade here and press it into the center of my lid. Look at that. Look at that shine. Okay, I just jacked up my liner, so now I gotta put my liner back on. Woo! All right, that's it. I am digging it. That is so pretty. I am going to get my mascara on. Of 
course, my Benefit Roller Lash. I do have some fallout. Brush that away, not too much. That was from the chunky shade. I am loving this look. It is, you know, it's crazy because LA Girl is my favorite inexpensive brand and Pat McGrath is my favorite expensive brand. And for such extremes in prices, now I'm not saying, I mean, this isn't comparable to Pat McGrath. There are no special but, shades. Um, I mean, <sighs> this is really an expensive looking look. Wow. Wow. I'm feeling myself. <laughs> okay, I just want to um, blend my, uh, I just want to blend it a little bit. A little bit better, but it is blending like a dream. Oh my god, this is like a smoke dream. Neutral lover's dream. Okay. Uh, this is definitely 10 star eyeshadow. Definitely this no words. Buy all these LA Girl palettes. Buy them all. Buy backups. <laughs> wow. Okay, that's it for this one. My name's Jackie. Please like, subscribe, leave me a message. Um, and LA Girl makes some other palettes. I haven't tried these. These are their old palettes that were $10.99. But if you want some more shades, this is the nudist. So that's a just expanded palette, but I, I, it doesn't look to me like this is the previous quality. This is not the same quality. These are just, I just wanted to show them to you just in case. Uh, this one is Surreal Dream. And it just has a nice mix of blues and pinks in there. The reason I picked these up when I was in there is since I got the other palettes for uh, free, I had a 20% off coupon. So actually, I was able to pick up all six of these palettes for like 20 bucks. So it was just a deal. And then this one is called Feverish. But again, the quality, just by looking at it, you can tell it's not the same. Um, you definitely want, but that's a really, really pretty palette for $11, and it does come with a mirror, which these other ones, uh, Break Free does. But if you want the new quality, um, you want their large palettes, um, or these have the same quality. So it looked like it was the same formula, and it exactly is. So I highly recommend these, um, and I just, I'm just blown away. I'm just blown away with the quality and um, whew. yeah. Gotta get them. All right, y'all, thanks a lot. Talk to you later, bye-bye.